Well, hey everybody, it's been a while. Um, just made a video today of uh, giving the cows a scour shot to prevent uh, cows from having scours when they're born, hopefully, shortly after there. Um, this is my new Blattner double alleyway um, into a single alley and then the chute. This is the first time these cows have been down this alley. Actually, these right here are replacement heifers, so they're kind of, they're just kind of what they are, I guess. Um, they're actually getting their booster shot right now, so fairly quick and painless for them, but just everyone getting uh, the right feeling and going. Took a little bit today, but we got them done. This group here, I think we had, oh, about 40 to shy of 40 in, a, in this group, and it took uh, about 20 minutes, so we rolled right through them, I think pretty happy with that. Uh, the cows today, they they seem like they were a little slow. I think the ice and the weather kind of messed with them. And it actually took us a long time to get them home. They're like in super slow motion today. Here shortly, uh, a drone video is going to be popping up side by side with this one. And, and they don't match. They won't match. The one on the screen now is actually the heifers and the, the drone footage is actually when we're working the cows but I thought you know we'd try to try to have them side by side and show everybody the different views. I actually had a couple other different camera angles. I had my camera glasses on for a while and I had to move this camera that we're watching on the right hand side to a different place but a couple times, but then I forgot to hit the start button. So, right there, you can see we're we're just learning these no backs on this alleyway. They're they're uh, just a little high for these heifers right now. And then uh, actually, some of the, the cows that we work in the drone footage there, some of them are actually heifers of my brothers and mine. So they're a little shorter than the cows, but. Our, our cattle aren't used to the no backs up above their head. They're used to a different style of no back. I like these better. They're a lot easier to adjust and get out of the way. Um, and just getting the cattle used to them, I think, is going to be the, the key here. Uh, I don't remember if I said that this is the first time that these animals went down this alleyway system and everything. So, overall, I'm pretty happy with how it worked. So I guess you guys can watch for a while and maybe you get bored, click off and, and uh, see you in the next one. And it does really seem like uh, the cattle you see in the drone footage there, they, they really like to follow one or the other. Sometimes they go down the, the north alley and sometimes they go down the south alley, I guess. Um, it's just kind of interesting how that works, I guess. And, you know, they're identical, they look the same, but it seems like sometimes they go down one and not the other and whatnot. But I did observe that today when we were that side to side, point that out as well you guys. If you notice on the drone footage there, once in a while there's a, a little delay in the, in the cattle movement. And a lot of that's caused by where we're doing some retaking and and it was cold enough today we were having uh, Hager problems actually. The, the buttons were breaking because the uh, cold temperatures, I guess. We tried to put them together and, and the plastic was hard and it ended up making the buttons break because we were having some te technical difficulties there. But, but yeah.
So I know uh, the, if you guys got any questions, don't be afraid to ask me down in the comments below. Even even if it's down the road a ways, I I should sure try to get back to all the comments that I can, and, and I try to be as helpful as as I can be with. If you have questions on this alleyway here, or uh, our butt box design, or even our alleyway, and I plan on making a lot more videos, hopefully with this alleyway and, and getting some better footage of it and uh, hopefully the cattle cooperate a little bit better the next time that I try uh, today just wasn't the day that they wanted to cooperate the best but anyhow I guess don't be scared to ask any questions if you want to down below Alright, well here uh, coming up you'll see a, a cow backing up on the drone footage side past the no front, no back and back down the alley. And uh, I wanted to point out that we have uh, come up with a solution to that problem. We haven't done it yet. Um, the ground's been a little froze for getting uh, the alleyway change and whatnot. There she went, she just backed up past it, but not a huge deal. We. Uh, we got a solution. The, the dealer that I bought my equipment from here by winter, he uh, he uh, talked to me and he talked to the company and, and, and we've come up to a solution that I, I really think is going to work good. Um, and, and they're willing to go above and beyond and custom make some things for me to make it work better for my place. So that's just showing how, uh, how good it is good this company treats it the people that buy their equipment so i just wanted to point that out there
Alright guys, we're coming up to 12 and a half minutes here. And that's probably about enough of this video. I guess hopefully you guys enjoyed it. Next time hopefully we can get some better footage with the drone and a couple other cameras, different angles and things like that. I guess other words we'll uh, see you guys on the flip side. Thanks for watching.